ago, Democratic Dallas County District Attorney Craig Watkins appeared to be cruising to re-election, but Watkins is hitting some speed bumps against Republican challenger Danny Clancy, a former prosecutor and judge, and the race is looking competitive with feathers flying literally. Channel 8's Brad Watson reports. <laughs> Anyone who thought the Dallas DA's race would remain a totally serious campaign lay an egg with that prediction. The Republican Party posted a chicken outside WFAA studios where candidate Danny Clancy appeared alone on Inside Texas Politics after Democrat Craig Watkins indicated he'd be there, but then declined, citing a scheduling conflict. This is an important campaign. It's important to the voters, and they need, need, need to know uh, who we are and what we stand for and what the differences are. Crime Clancy believes he's in a race now. Down. Republicans think Watkins is vulnerable after his handling of the constable's investigation. And for the recent public screaming match, Watkins got into with county commissioners over the budget. Although Republicans are encouraged, beating Watkins remains a big challenge. Watkins points out that crime is down, his conviction rate is solid, and that he's freed those unjustly convicted. But perhaps his biggest advantage is that Dallas County is turning bluer. And the Democrats have been growing their margin about 2% each electoral cycle. So it's a bigger Democratic margin than it was in either 6 or 8, but not a good Democratic year. So the margin won't grow, but I think the Democratic slate is probably in pretty good shape. But if a lot of Democratic voters stay home in what's supposed to be a Republican year, the chickens could come home to roost for Watkins. Brad Watson, Channel 8 News. And you can watch Inside Texas Politics this Sunday morning during the 9 o'clock hour of News 8 Daybreak.